Okay, here we are at the mystery location, and I'm with the mystery pilot of the day. We're CCA, <laughs> classic classified aircraft. Uh, don't listen to him. <laughs> okay, this is where we're at. We're at Willow, An Willow Run Airport, and we're going to see some old planes. This is the uh, Yankee Air Force Museum. And if you guys want, you can go right over here to the girls and they'll sign in. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Okay. You need my paperwork? Nope. Okay. Who are all these other people that are not with you? This one here. This one here. Okay. okay. This is so cloudy. <laughs> I can't see. <laughs> you can make it clear. I just bought I just bought a pack of those. I want to see how they are. They fit on the baseball cap. You stick your bill through them. Oh nice. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. That would yeah. be nice. They should be coming in the next couple of days. Okay, you can just can we walk around? Feel free to walk around. Back just be careful because the pavement is kind of bumpy. Okay. okay. You remember your social distancing. Um, there's some, there's uh, veterans back there. Oh, I saw one guy back there. Docents back here, back there. You can ask anybody questions, anybody that you want to ask questions, you can, you can ask them. Or if you need other questions, come find one of us or we'll be walking around. But. Take as many pictures as you like. There's a plane back there you can actually walk up to. Okay. Okay. So Thank have you. fun. Enjoy your day. Thank you. RB fifty seven.
you, sir? I'm good. So this is uh, Naval Security Group stuff? No. This, the airship? It was a, this airplane was used for a lot of different things. Ah, okay. This particular airplane started out as a picket aircraft, it was called. Ah. It flew the Atlantic Barrier. And they would fly off Argentia, Newfoundland, or Keflavec, Iceland, depending. Uh -huh. And they would fly, they'd have four airplanes in the air, 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. Oh, okay. Searching over the poles. You know what the dew line was? Oh, yeah. Well, these, this was an extension of the dew line. I myself flew in them over the Pacific, off Midway Island to the uh, Aleutians and back. Okay. And then this airplane was also used as a spy. So it's uh, amazing, you know, that Willow Run here, they used to make the bombers during World War II. So, uh, I don't know if you can hear me, they made, they made the bombers during World War II here at Willow Run. And inside of airplane hangars, they always amaze me, the size of these things. Look at these aircraft inside here. including airlines or anybody else. When I came home from Boston, um, what he's talking about is just flying the racetrack route like from Midway to Alaska and back uh, as an extension of the dew line to enter to uh, catch if the Russians were coming or anybody else who didn't have authorized flight permits. But they were also used for uh, This is not uh, the Air Yankee Air Force Museum. This is a hangar at Willow Run Airport where they're having a uh, special show for members. And I'm not a member, but my friend is, so that's what that all about. So now we'll go back downstairs. They get these planes donated or something and then they try to restore them. And that is our mystery adventure for today. 
tune in again same time no <laughs> tune in again to mo photo detroit bye bye i gotta put this in my vlog Wait, and say hello. Hello. <laughs> I'm Rosie. Rosie the Riveter. And on the outside of the building, if you notice these large rails, uh -huh. those are curtain rails. Oh. And they were put up with giant curtains because these doors had windows. So anywhere in the building where there were windows, they installed the curtain rails so that they, it could be blacked out I if see. needed. Because um, Detroit being the arsenal of democracy oh, yeah. was a target during the war. Plenty of spies. Yes, and so um, that was a precaution that they built to ensure... We are at the Yankee Air Museum observing planes that were used during the Cold War. Not a historian, but I believe this was the first jet plane that had to sweep sweep wings for the United States. And you're literally just sitting on top of the uh, jet engine in this aircraft. You can see the heavy influence, at least in my opinion. That's the taunt cat back there. Or no, that's the voodoo. My mistake. Is this used for submarine hunting? This one? I don't know. I don't think so. This is an Air National Guard. It's probably some kind of a medium bomber. You see? It's an RB-47. Do you remember that movie, Dr. Strangelove? Right. Okay. Dr. Strangelove, they had uh, RB-47s with nukes, you know. This is the one where he rode down on the ground? No, no. They, that was a different plane, but 
RB-47, back in that day, that was the nuclear carrier. Now these over here, this is a caribou on the right. That's an army plane. And that caribou, the tail comes down, and then the guys would parachute out of that. Good paratrooper thing. Well, what do you think of your little tour? I mean, it's interesting. You know, I want to get it straight out here.